Hop on. We'll fill you in on the way. No, I'm driving. Fine. All right, let's get this over with. You was quiet in there. Took everything I had. That son of hers. I'll shove that silver spoon down his throat and pull it clean out of his ass. The smug fucker. Okay. So what she got us doing at the Gray's place? Now go to wreck the wagon. She wants us to torture tobacco fields. Said they ain't had rain in weeks round here. What? Yep. Yeah, using that back there. Moonshine? Burns faster than kerosene, that stuff. Said it'd be fitting she did. All I'm thinking is how about I try fitting my boot up your hook No, just snotty old bitch. Jose really picked Easy. the right fella for tea at the manor, didn't he? Last time we let you drive. Ah, oh, he was giving his usual flannin. One of these families got gold stashed somewhere, he reckons. I mean, I'm off for sticking it to rich folks. I hate rich folks. They're really barely some bloody money at the end of all this. Jose knows what he's doing. Does he, though? The master finagler of nothing. Easy, easy. So far, we've destroyed the Braithwaite still. Tried to sell the shine back to them. Now we're on this fool's errand, which I'm very much looking forward to, by the way. They were saying old man Gray's double security after that business at the saloon. They just robbed their horses, too. That was you? Jesus. So, we're just gonna... Yeah. Whoa, hold up a second. Are you not worried about them Greys, English? Excuse me? You not worried about them Greys? Yeah, in what sense? Well, they knows you. Yeah, maybe you're right. You know what? Here, I'll go hide and back. If you can act naturally and stop us from getting into a fight before we're ready. I will try. Yes. Try and do an impression of a human being. I'm not going to go that far. <laughs> I'll do the talking. Hey, hold it right there. What you want, boy? I've, I've, there, there was a thing, a, a, a thing, at the saloon. What you talking about? Well, I'm delivering the supplies. You're not the usual driver. Uh, you want a bottle, friend? Here. Uh, uh, have a wee drop. <laughs> I'm new. I, I mean you no harm. Uh, <laughs> I, I've come from Donegal in, in Ireland. You don't say. said you'd understand uh, some kind of incident at the saloon in town. I, I was told to bring this up here. Ask no questions, I'll tell you no lies, uh, sort of business. Uh, uh, before the officials got there, okay. they said. Okay, Drive this way. I'll show you how to get there. Oh, thank you, friend. Uh, have a drink, Sean. <coughs> Hamish. Good to meet you, Hamish. <laughs> uh, fine bit of country you've got here. I'm not as fine as Connemara, but fine nonetheless. My people come from Scotland. Is that right? And you and I are nearly brothers. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Just over here. Yeah, it's straight down the path here. It's getting so I can barely keep track of all these deliveries coming in. Yeah, when they said they was looking for more drivers in town, I jumped at the chance. I ain't never been a feller to kick a bit of honest work out of bed. <laughs> so, you folks been having a hard time of it, have you? Yeah, Mr. Gray's got a heap of problems right now with another family around here. Bunch of covetous lowdowns trying to sabotage his livelihood. Disgusting. Oh dear, oh dear, I'm sorry to hear that, Hamish. Sounds like you definitely deserve that drink. 
You don't know the half of it. Just in there. Ah, uh, right there. <laughs> you can unload it here. In here? Oh, <laughs> the horse is like a, a swift one, <clears throat> do they? <laughs> Excuse me? Um, nothing. It's grand. <clears throat> Quite a place you yeah. boys have got here. <laughs> Reminds me of one of them big houses there, uh, out in Donegal. Huh. Real fancy places they was, Hamish. Real fancy, because if some folks got all the money, they can build quite the fanciest. <laughs> oh, <laughs> you know, open here till it gets down. <laughs> Quiet. There's someone coming on the left. That's good for here. That's good. That should do it. I'm gonna delve this too.
Let's just get out of here first. I think we lost them. That we did. Quite a night. Sure. Interesting little fight Dutch has put us into the middle of here. Uh, I hope him and Jose are right and that there's some money at the end of it. Well, what now? Head on back to camp. You coming? Later. I, I got some business. Right you are, English. Another job well done, I'd say. <laughs> 